You tried to screen record a clip from your favorite streaming service like Netflix, Disney Plus, Hulu, or Amazon Video. This is gonna be super easy, you thought, but quickly you ran into this issue, the dreaded black screen. Instead of spending hours trying to find a solution like I did, you can just watch this video to skip the frustration and start capturing clips from popular TV shows and movies to use in your next YouTube video or social media post. Step one, download and use Chrome. Be sure that you're using Chrome because it's the only browser that I've actually been able to make this work on. Step two, install and use a screen recording app that also allows us to capture the system audio or the internal audio of your computer. This way you capture both the video and the audio of the clips that you want. Now I use Loom for this. The first 25 videos are free and it's pretty easy to use. And no, I'm not being paid to mention them in this video. Now, if you need to record a lot of clips, a free alternative is OBS, which doesn't have the same limit on how many video recordings that you can use but it is a little bit more tricky to set up. The settings between the two will be different. However, I do have a separate video on how you can do screen recording with OBS. No matter which one that you use, the overall process is the same. So you will want to finish this video first. Okay, so real quick, we're going to sign up and download Loom and then hit install. While that's going, if you don't know who I am, my name is Steven Records and I'm the founder of contentthunder.com where we give businesses and content creators everything that they need to build their audience online with services like content strategy, video editing, thumbnail creation, content optimization, and more. Step three, set up the screen recording preferences. All right, so now let's just open the app and then we're gonna need to adjust some preferences really quick. If you are using OBS, then you'll wanna draw from the settings in the other video. But for Loom, we're gonna first set the default quality to 1440 then make sure that the highlight mouse clicks is set to off. Next, we're gonna turn off the option to show your control menu. Set the record audio and mono to on and then make sure use system audio is on. Then go back to the main page and change the recording settings to none for both the camera and the mic. We don't want those getting in the way while we're recording clips. Step four, change your browser settings. Now, if you try to hit record at this point, you're just gonna get that black screen. To fix that, we need to open up our Chrome browser, then go to settings, system, and turn off use hardware acceleration when available. And then we're gonna relaunch the browser. Before you start recording your clips, it's important to know about the restrictions around how you can use them without getting your video taken down, or even worse, your entire account banned permanently due to copyright issues. Fair use is what we call this in the US. It is called different things in other countries, but I'll leave a link to an article put out by YouTube that was really helpful for me in understanding it in the description. Now, with that out of the way, the last step is to record your clips. To do that, go to any streaming service that you wanna use and then click on the video that you want to record. Now go to the part of the video that you wanna get a clip from and then set the video to full screen. I also like to start my video a few seconds back from where I want it to give it some time for the controls to disappear. You then just press record. You might also have to confirm that you're okay with your microphone being turned off. Now that it's recording, go ahead and play the video and ensure that your cursor is out of the way and left alone. Once you've captured the part that you need, just stop the recording and now you have the clip ready to go. To download the clips, you're just gonna go to the three dots and then hit download. If this was helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave me a comment if you have any questions and be sure to check out this next video.